Welcome back to the last and final installment in the MCC training guideline. In this particular section, we're going to talk a little bit about search. Wow, what a powerful thing that is. Now, I believe that LinkedIn is as successful as it is because of their fantastic search capability. I, when I grow up, man, I want Motor City Connect to have exactly the same. We don't. It's not bad, but it's not quite as good as theirs. But I will tell you what, it will help you find what you're looking for. You can do search on pretty much any page. Wow, look right here, right on the home page, how fun. We have the option to search everything. We have the option to search discussions or search file cabinet. And if you saw the MCC share, or the MCC photo file video, you'll know what that file cabinet is. I like to search either discussions or everything, and everything's where we are if we're looking for profiles. So let's say I met a great person named Katie the other day, and I need to connect with her. I don't know Katie's last name. All I need to do is type Katie into this box right here, and M the MCC search is going to show me the things about Katie. All right, well, here's a Katie Morasso, here's a Katie Hayes, here's a Katie Brown, here's a Katie Peterson, here's a Katie Baller. And anyone else that mentioned the word Katie in their in their profile, like Bridget said, she was referred by Katie Morasso. Thanks, Katie, um, to the site. So that's kind of cool. Now I can narrow it down a little bit. Right here, this is one of the reasons that we say it's so important to put some information in your profile, Katie Brown, because now I'm not really sure if that's the Katie I'm looking for because it doesn't tell me anything about her. Rats. That's why profiles are important. But okay, let's say we weren't really worried about Katie. Let's say that we needed to find an attorney. Well, now I'm going to type an attorney and see what comes up. All right, and the dice are rolled, and the results are, holy cow, 135 hits. Yikes. Remember now, a lot of people are looking to meet attorneys, so that doesn't necessarily mean that Terry McKeown is going to be an attorney. In fact, I know he's not. He's looking to meet those folks. Business owners dealing with small to mid size, and he's giving an example. Where is Tom Olszewski? Hope I pronounced that right. Tom says that he is an attorney. So we've got to pay a little bit of attention here. Steven's definitely an attorney, and then Mark's looking to actually meet attorneys. So we've got to mix it up a little bit. Mark Melman, one of my favorite attorneys. Wow, Mark, you owe me for that. <laughs> Just kidding. Lori Williams does an outstanding job of helping people find attorneys. You know, much like all search engine optimization, if you have a specialty or an area of expertise, you want to use that word a few times because the more it shows up in your profile, the higher it will return in the search results. Kind of fun. Let's say I wasn't really worried about attorneys. Let's say I was going to have a bunch of meetings in... Yeah, I don't want to do Troy. Lots of people in Troy. I was going to have a bunch of meetings in Commerce, Michigan. And I thought, gosh, what if I could find some other people that were in Commerce? Let's see how that works out for me. Okay, 348. Oh, look at that. Interesting, interesting. Chamber of Commerce. That doesn't really help, does it? Um, so what if we put down Commerce Township? Because that's really what we're looking for is Commerce Township. Not Chamber of Commerce, that's for sure. Oh, four. That doesn't seem right. Although that's a lot of people that actually use it properly. So we have to we have to mess around with that. Great example, Terry. Way to pick one that's a complete and total fail. Hey, you know, what if I was looking to meet with people less Bloomfield is what I meant to say. Oh gosh, this is fun. How'd you spend your Sunday morning? That's what I want to know. Hundred and fifteen folks that are in the West Bloomfield area. Again, recognize that this may be people that have an office in West Bloomfield or like to do work in West Bloomfield or live in West Bloomfield, but it does certainly help narrow it down a little bit. Couldn't have just picked Livonia, which would have been easy, right? So, anyway, those are three or four different examples of how to use the search function. Like all good social media, man, trial and error is the way to go. So play around with this. Very powerful when you use it properly. Thanks so much for taking the time to view this presentation, and as always, be connected.